Welcome to the show. My guest is Jason. Jason, why are you here? Steve, I'm here because uh, I was with my ex-girlfriend for six years, the worst six years of my life. You know, we, uh, we went through a lot of problems. I broke up with her about a year ago, and um, I, got, I, met, I met a great girl. Her name is Rebecca. You know, we've been together for 11 months. Everything was perfect. Out of the blue, my, my baby mom calls me, and she says that, uh, that there's problems, that, that uh, my daughter is saying that Rebecca <laughs> toothbrush and my two-year-olds. So your ex calls you up and says that your current girlfriend sexually assaulted your two-year-old daughter. Yes, sir. Yeah. So, uh, so I'm so me, me, no, me, no, and Angela. I'm just like, well, why didn't you take her to the hospital? You know what I mean? Like that's that, that's the first thing anybody would have done is take her to the hospital, find out what's going on. She said, well, I don't want, I don't want to go through the problems. We, you know, we already got problems with with our worker and our DSS worker and. A lot of other things, so I'm... So I'm, she says this to you, and then you ask her, why didn't you take her to the hospital? And she says, I don't want any problems? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Do you think she's coaching your daughter to say this? Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah, I think she's coaching my daughter to say it, because she's, she's, she's manipulative. She doesn't, she doesn't want to see me alone. And your girlfriend now, she's a good person, good woman? Awesome woman, bro, awesome And you woman. would never think that she would be capable Not of doing Not even in a million years. Like my family, nobody. Well, we're going to bring out your ex, Angela, and we're going to find out what she has to say. I'll show you... Crazy. First of all, <laughs> first swear. of all, when I told you that I was going to bring a kid to the doctor because of what happened, I called you and I said I looked her over and I didn't see anything that was there, but I'm going to make an appointment with her doctor. You was like, bring her to the emergency room. And what I said to you is I'm going to call, call a DSS worker, I'm going to talk to her and bring her to the doctors. That way, if we bring her to the emergency room, my child doesn't get taken away from me because you're too asinine to believe what the hell she's saying. You told me I, I 100% I didn't, I, I, I didn't believe I didn't believe what you were saying, bro. Believe your I didn't you were saying. This is your I didn't daughter. Believe what you were saying. This is your daughter. I'm crazy. You're crazy. I'm crazy. You're crazy. And you're an idiot. You're crazy. I take violence from you, putting your hands on me Who's all the time. Who's the scars? Who's the, the scars? I'm defending myself from you, putting your damn hands on me. Okay, Are you Angela. serious? Okay, Are you Angela. serious? Okay, Angela. So you're saying he raped you, right? Well, I, you know what? To me. And, and this is what I told your producers, rape is, is like a violent thing. He wasn't violent as in hitting me around or whatever. What he did to me, did he forced no? himself on me. I said no. I said no over and over and over again. Over again. Yo, over see, again. You see, you see, you see, I'm talking don't touch see, me. Hey, and now you see who's the violent one, and right? And he pushed me down. Now and you know what? One. I didn't fight. I should have stabbed you. That's what I should have done. But you know what? I didn't fight because I didn't want the police once again to come to our house for a domestic over you and then I go to jail. A domestic over me? Domestic hold over on, me. Hold you on, hold on. You don't give a about the obviously. You, know I want you, you left my baby with a crackhead right. so you could go potty for one night. Do you believe that your daughter was sexually assaulted? Something happened to my daughter. A two-year-old is not going to say, Mommy, somebody touched her. You know what I'm saying? Like, when she first told me, of course, I flipped out. I checked my child. I didn't see nothing out of the ordinary. When I called her father, like, my daughter... Right now, it's just as a parent. How do you feel about the fact that now they, they took Rebecca's kids away because of this? You, you know what? If, if, she, if it comes out that she did this, then good. She needed her damn kids taken away before she does it to them. Let's bring out Rebecca. Angela, you know damn well that I never touch your kid, Angela. Angela, I never touch your kid. I never touch your kid. I don't know that. Oh wow! Oh wow! She said that. Man, 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 she said it. Man, 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 she said it. Man, man, she said it. Two years old. 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 Doctor, she told me that. Did you molest never, Angela's daughter? I would daughter? never do that to her. I love, I love that baby. That baby, I would I treat all her kids. And how all, was the relationship kids, like, with the, with the great. baby? Great. We always played dodgeball. We would play in the back in the park. We would color. I always, so this is just crazy, crazy this allegation. This is crazy. This is, it came from nowhere. Like it, it was like left field. Like a ball hit me in the face. When, did, when you heard about the accusations, how did you react? Well, she called on the phone. 
And um, I was like, what? I was like, you're kidding me, right? He was like, no. And I was like, oh, they go, she ain't take her to the doctor? She's like, nah, she don't want to get in trouble. I said, get in no trouble. I said, the only one that's going to get in trouble is me. Tell her I'm willing to get in trouble to make sure that nothing happened to that baby. She still didn't take her. Two weeks went by. She came on a Saturday. The baby came on a Saturday. I made Jay and his sibling take him to the hospital. Jay, what Jay was saying wasn't true. He didn't. I'm the one that said, Jason, you're going to talk to your daughter alone in a room. I don't want to even be around. You're going to confront you. You're going to tell your daughter to talk to you. Tell her what happened. Let, let you know. I don't know, they went, in, they went in the bedroom. I walked out, I let them talk. He's like, I'm gonna take my daughter to the hospital. He did, they said everything was fine. The police came, they made the report. They've already found me under, uh, I'm a sexual perpetrator, and that, that I can't have my kids unless, um, you know, unless they get classes or whatever and admit to doing this. Like, I'm not gonna admit that, because I didn't do that. Results for Angela. Did Jason force himself on you sexually? You answered yes. Did you have consensual sex with Jason three weeks ago? You answered no. The results for Angela on that part of the lie detector test is she told the truth. Babe, you. you know better, babe. You know I never had to force myself on yeah. you, you see, you, you see how she throws right? herself at me. You lies, seen right? it. You seen it. You see how she throws herself at me. You I never had to take you know nothing. I told you about the lie detector test, so. Angela, you were then asked, did you molest your daughter? You answered no. And the results for that part of the lie detector test is that Angela told the truth. <laughs> results for Rebecca. Did you sexually abuse Jason's daughter? You answered no. Have you ever physically harmed Jason's daughter? You answered no. And the results for your lie detector test is that Rebecca has told the truth. <laughs> no. The results for Jason. Did you molest your daughter? You answered no. Did you tell your daughter to say that someone else molested her? You answered no. And the results for your lie detector test is that you did not tell the truth. Confessions from Jason. Jason confessed to being forceful with Angela when she objected. Jason wow. confessed to having sex with Angela without her consent. Jason confessed that Angela said no to sex and he continued to penetrate her. That's oh, I didn't confess to none of that. The dude, hey, yo, the dude put a lot of tattoos. The dude to the light is that the test. You confess this. You confess. So that's what that's saying? Is that saying I'm going to my kid? Yeah, that's what it's saying. You know what you did. I never touched my kid. Touch my kid. I want another test. Is it a leap of faith? You raped this woman. I didn't rape her. You forced her. Get that scumbag off my stage. You called the show, you wanted to clear your name, you wanted my help, you got it. Now it's what you, it's, it's what you do with it now. Be strong and stay away from guys like that. Let your children, do not let any man ever let your children get taken away. Let's go. Well, you know what? You it's know not going to be good if I take you know care what? of it. You know what? Bring him to jail. You know what? Because he's you know not what? coming back to you know Then let's, let's go call be... the police together let's right now. Let's go right now.